Good morning guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you are doing well. It's uh, morning this side, that's why the sun is just rising. The sun rises, rises from the east and sets to the western region. Is it west or western region? Yes, I hope you're doing well. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Please subscribe if you haven't. Like this video. Comment what you think and uh, share if you can. But just like, comment and uh, subscribe if you haven't. To the returning subscribers, thank you so much for your support and love. To the new subscribers, welcome to this amazing, amazing family. It's very early in the morning and uh, as you know, day by day, I post videos of the daily activities. Yesterday I went to look for a hose pipe and fair enough I had to give up. Sometimes you just have to give up because what you want is not what you get. So I was looking for a hose pipe, green one, uh, not necessarily green. I, I think I showed you in the previous video. If you haven't watched that one, I think uh, you should go back and watch. Along the way, of that video this is the one i wanted yesterday this one i'm not really concerned about the color but the type eh? because this one can last for years you know if you're doing something you just you should just do something once and for all instead of buying one today after two years you go and buy another one nobody wants to be in that position where you just keep spending on the same thing for years and years and years so I haven't, I didn't find it and uh, I had to just come back. I think I'll walk and uh, maybe I'll, 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 I'll go back, maybe check if they have ordered for it because I told them to order. I don't think if they'll do so any soon. I need that hose pipe to be watering, especially my fence. I really need this fence to, to grow because sometimes you just want to be staying in a very hidden place eh? place like this and this is my perimeter wall eh? so if this fence is like this then people just can just get to see what's going on in, in this compound and that's what i don't want it's not like i'm planning to do anything fishy but that privacy that's why people build perimeter walls apart from security it offers privacy and now for this one this is my privacy because believe me if these flowers will grow well and uh, this one on the fence this tony tree what are these these are ladybirds or what are these see this they seem to be is it a disease or something i don't think so seem to be something's egg eh? this seems to be an egg yeah so this one will grow and the flowers and this one should when you're planting this one you should have a, a at least a, a, a barbed, not barbed wire but this chain link fence eh? because it needs to be wound on this fence like this like this so its stems are always also strong this is just another job that you have to have gloves Austin Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm Yeah, so that one we need to have a chain link. So the reason was why I need that hose pipe is to water this. And some places like this, I'll have to replace replace the 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 ones that maybe wilted here or something. And water this fence daily. That's my plan. Because I've been waiting for rain, it's not coming. I have to do it my own way. I don't know if you can see that pole there. I really need that pole to be changed. So I talked to one of the men from Kenya Power because that line is bending like this. It's exacting exerting a lot of pressure on that pole. Considering the cables come from this side and the other pole is the other side. So this cables lag, it's like a V. 
the cable is going the other way, lags the other side, and this one, this other side, and that pole doesn't have a uh, support. Eh? So soon, if it rains, I think it the, the pole might fall. Eh? So that's why I talked to them and told them that at least I should, they should come and try to either give that pole support or just create another or dig another hole for it and uh, put it lagging the leaning this other side eh? so that when the, the cables come the pressure doesn't make it break because it's already bending towards that direction i don't know who put it like that because this is hardly how many months now six months yeah so i'll have to change that one yesterday the boys did some job and uh, my plumber also did some job i think my my guardian also need trimming that's the problem with these writings after a while you have to trim them because otherwise they'll overgrow and after overgrowing now they miss, they lose meaning eh? because it should be a writing of that height And now leaving it to overgrow now makes it even bushy. So every after every one week you have to be trimming, 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 and that's that's too much work. But anyway, you need so the plumber, this is what the plumber did yesterday. He finished everything. Water is in the house. If you can open this T valve, uh, gate valve, water can get in. Eh? So everything is done. You can see the the, the back filling of this trenches they dug and now the place is very very this 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 slope is irregular i think i should get someone to work on it this one is still left out because this is a get one i don't know who put it outside the plumber was saying that uh, whoever did the piping could have given a provision for the T valve, the gate valve to be inside the house because this one, when kids are playing, you can think that there's no water, and probably they, they have closed it. So that's why gate valves should always be inside the house nowadays, at least modern, modern building. Yeah, I also have a problem with this tap. This tap is very tough. When you want to open it, you have to use a lot of force. I don't know if I'll just have to replace it. That's too much force. I don't know it's because of water pressure, but even if it's about pressure, the other taps also have the same pressure. But at least for them, you can uh, you can open them easily. Ajangonyota is Washing his clothes here. Achim, yes. good morning. Morning, brother. You started washing these clothes yesterday. And I, up I, to now, you have not finished. And there are only three trousers and three tops. I had to soak the trousers. Oh, you have to soak? Yeah. Were they too dirty? Yeah. Because of dust, eh? Mm. No problem. This is my well. We're still curing it because it was made. It was made the other. Yeah, two days ago. Austin is listening to gospel music. Good morning, Austin. Morning. Say hi to people, one. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Austin woke up today with the left, the left leg. Yeah, so this way I'll be, I'll be, I'll be taking the water for weeding or for for irrigation from. So that was pipe, maybe it's like 100 meters tall, eh? it will be always be inserted here. Then, the grass around this area will be really getting a lot of water. Well, there's water guys, water is here. We have a lot, a lot, a lot of it. The water tank now is full. See that pressure?
So I'll be tying that in a uh, hose pipe there and opening the tap for irrigation. You see, my flowers, they are really suffering from lack of water. Even if you see the leaves, I know they can't dry up, but I know if I water them, they'll be growing so fast. And that's what I want to do. Because around this area, near the toilet, and I have another tap here, near the toilet, this one. Eh? some rocks and create something there down there to hold this standpipe eh? so if you check around this area you see how this one has really grown eh? and the leaves are also healthy that is because this is a this is a bathroom and when people take shower that water do come and accumulate here so they sip that water so that's why even the the flowers around this area have really grown faster. Eh? So yesterday the boys did this. Oh, what happened to my camera? And they are already coming. They are down there. You can see them coming. They were digging trenches. I think I should get a key for them. Should get a key. Ochiang! Tell us to help me with the key. I want to show you what they did yesterday. Now, the toughest decision now I have is to, because the next thing is now tiling. Eh? That's what uh, the plumber already did his job. He left. The part that is left is for him to fix. Eh? After. Ochien! Osto! Konyaki market! He'll fix them after after we've done uh, tiling. The electrician he left for somewhere. He'll come back. Not all light has been fixed, but it's just a matter of connecting the switches, eh? Because power is there. I found out so the problem to what was happening. They are in, in the same line with mine. There was someone who had his cables pass through a tree. So those cables were very close. So when wind blows, those cables were meeting each other. And you see, as you know, the neutron and the live wire should not meet. So after meeting, they spark. And the transformer could sense it and the fuse would fall because that's the, cut, the function of a fuse. The transformer could sense that there are some cables that have, have met, so it, the fuse falls. And now we have no power and it can't come back until somebody goes back there again and re return it. And the same kept happening. So when I called them yesterday, they came and said that uh, they should look where the problem is and they walked around, found that tree, cut it down. And now at least I believe, at least I believe that there will be power 
for a while eh? even if it gets lost it won't be lasting like two weeks the way it, it did the other time i wanna be getting some trees and flowers to plant on these holes I have around 8-7 of them I also think I should replace this I don't know if we should just water it or we should replace but for this one for sure we'll have to replace because it doesn't seem to be healthy at all even dead so this one I know it will catch up this is the big man we just shade this leaves and watch how are you good morning how are you good morning. how are you yeah so this is what they did yesterday and i want to want to show you and they should finish by today because pain is very 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 difficult Check it. Show Nadi. Oh, Nigo, yeah, right. Nigo, you're not kind of. Oh, my not an eno. Bapa, no, when you're eno machon, Mokongo. I know, my Oh, hm. Hm. This chloride of lime is used to treat well water. So we'll mix it in a water solution and pour it in the, in the well. Just a water treatment plan. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, koro... Hmm. 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 Koro kanad biro, the power manu miss call machon. Bukoro no kade okra gocho da. Hey, ni do aru wani ni wa. Mano e gigo to onge pod no ka wuok ngano watiek video ni abiro yudi kanyo sanito koro ka naise mana kuru we ala fugo na nyinya ka yat eh ai kod ni ka mane ngane wacho e boka eh kuyo ntie maromo eh mato kuyo no roma roma sa magoto be anu tum eh abiro kanyo wadwa no wu e matin yeah so we want to treat that water because uh, you know it's in the well it's not safe for drinking but if you treat it now it's safe it doesn't mean that every water that comes from the ground is safe for drinking that's what people assume but that's not the case so at least you should try and treat water because you don't know uh, what's down there even if, if, if you are sure the water seems clear but if, for drinking purposes you have to treat water and it's good to treat it from the source. So that is always poured after every six months. Just mix it and pour it in the well. So this is the, what, what the boys did yesterday. And they, and they are supposed to do it today as well. They were digging this. This is for water because rain is almost coming. And it's because of that water that that road is somehow has some holes so i don't know what to call them so we decided that we're gonna build this if i get money they'll be plastered we'll just create some two brick bricks eh? on either side and plaster the the base eh? so it will just be going like this and the boys are supposed to spread eh? all this sand from there, some soil entered my gum boot. My gum boots are very clean.
rule number one never wash your gum boots just do like this eh? they are safe because that layer of dirt makes it stronger at least that's the quote from the lazy people so this is what is going on or what happened yesterday they dug this area and they are gonna dig it today as well the other side they are also digging but they have to remove some what are these called in english visikis these ones this one they have to remove this they have another one there but they dug that from up there so this depression here for now i don't think i'll do much about it because it needs a lot of money but the thing is we'll remove this all this soil and throw it somewhere there then after that if i find money one day i'll cluster these trenches but what i have to do immediately is when it starts to rain i'll plant trees eh? and the trees i'll plant two or three lines i'll have one then two then leave a space then a, another one one then two uh, the, the other side because the trench is near somebody's fence i won't plant at, uh, any tree beyond it eh? but the other side the trench is almost see the space here this is my land so i'll have to be planting one here then another line here and measure six meters wide road leave a space for that and the rest of the it will plant trees in very straight lines yeah so that's what the boys are here to do today finish where they didn't because this area now this one were dug long time ago so so this one, we just have to remove them.
I think after uh, after having a cover crop here, then these trenches won't be of useful so much because the water is sweeping the soil away because of lack of cover crop. Eh? I don't know why soil is getting into my beef so much. I was expecting it to rain yesterday, but it didn't. So he's gonna do it like that up to down here. <laughs> Just let the water go flow easy. Mutara makoni nucha poka na kich kocha. Seno nogi kanka. It's a fruit. Okay. So the boys will be. This is now branching here. It's not an easy task. Eh? First, we put some marrow here. Finishing this, I think we have to plow this area. Yeah, so that's it, guys, for what happened yesterday. Uh, I'll show you, I'll give you an update of what will be done today in the following video for now let me go home show you how well it's treated so that at least you drink some clean water if you if maybe it might be dirty in appearance but it's safe for drinking eh? no germs no nothing but mine is clean eh? so if you're using dirty water just dig a well it's really difficult to it's very expensive to hire that uh, what is it called that machine that do dig well it's almost 1.2 million from at least 800 1.2 yes digging a well like this can barely cost hundred thousand can barely cost hundred thousand so but it also depends with you some people are rich have money they need things done the right way so that's good for you if you can afford it it's the best eh? the machine one but if you can't then just go our way you say oh let's check oh oh it's 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 covered it so I don't know if it 
yako mm. uh, my bad so you just mixed it in water and then poured it inside there it's gonna be safe kora nyalo mna go iki full kendo to kifungu na skin na digo kendo Austin Eh will go Adwa no go low mani besen no ina na di chage Elo ni besen Eh Oh yeah Elo ni jere ni keta ki di marama Eh ni kechu Wait na na ni gino kachi ngo no Eh Onya lo ba re bodo nti Eh ba re ne go pro jakre ndonje Ijo nyalo jo gya jo wadonge. Ah. I want to remove the soil that we put in this basin. And we also want to do some curing. Kela only want to. Hmm. We are curing that. We are putting that water. How do you do you cure water? Sell. Ah. Odo ka do kama. Mantena lo da sei. Mm. Tsi ma mule onge. The water is somewhere here. Ano no po ng kwase na tikod no po ng bupu kere mo alo koch. Kire? This berber koch nyo chwe koch. Hmm? Ani ni chwe nyo ri nyo koch. Oh. Ani kanyo mo na kore yanyo no. Koto chwe kan? This one should be removed from here. To will to make that. Water, it's a little bit to mix that that uh, where is the switch this is my switch so it means that there's enough sunlight it's around it's around 8.31 in the morning the same sun is somehow getting strong the water is now going up yeah so now the toughest decision we have is to decide the kind of tiles we want to use that's a really hard one thank you so much for this video guys uh, let's meet in the next one subscribe please it's free subscription is free subscribe like this video comment and uh, let's miss in the next one
now I was wondering why I've switched on my water pump and I can't hear water getting into the tank. So I was like, is this pump having a problem or what's the, what's the issue? Because they changed my controller real just some less than a week ago. So I had to climb, climb up here, see where I am. It's very risky here. You can even fall any any time. So if you don't watch this video, if you don't see this video, just know that I fell. But then I've come here and I've realized that the tank is almost full. As you can see, water is almost full, and now it's even overflowing. I didn't even know it has started overflowing. Eh? So I have, and, I have to go and uh, switch off the water pump. Now it's this overflow that I wanted to collect eh? by a 10,000 liters pump. See how it's overflowing? It's because it's full here. Very full. Look at inside there. Very, very full. It's clean, eh? You treated the water. Wilco, yeah. switch na e tangi na off, eh? Nini water pump no? There's nothing here. I felt like. Uh, if we put something there, you know, this is plastic, it will give it weight and over time it will sink. Eh? This one will crack and break off. After breaking off, see how my water pump is now. Those flowers are really enjoying it there. They'll be very green because every time we have overflow water. They'll be very, very healthy. It's healthy, man. Yeah. Let me go down. Wash my hands. I don't know if it's smelling. They put some. It's just around 10 a.m. Literally 10. It's around then 9. And the water tap pump. Water tap. The water tank is already full. Just with this. The sun is not even that strong. But the pump is very, very okay. It means I have water, guys. People should come and take shower here. I can wash the whole village. Assuming I had 10,000 liters, which I'll, I'll order for one, if I get money there, then this overflow, I could have collected it with some pipes and taken it to the 10,000 because that's the plan I have. For it to overflow and fill the 10,000 liters, hey, that will be too much water. Not even. <sighs> See how it is flowing? And it's even sipping from those small holes that were created for overflows like that. These flowers will be feeling very well. Because the water now. Now once it's full like that, we call it a day. We won't pump until tomorrow. Now every someone must always be alert and active. Actively watching for overflow. That's why I have to collect ten thousand. 
I have to buy 10,000 liters tank because if somebody was not around, that's too much water we could have lost. But if I had 10,000 liters, for it to overflow until the, the 10,000 liters is full, then that will be very, very. It will really take long. Because uh, when the water tamp, tamp, uh, tank is full like that, the pressure is also good down here. You can just see. It's too much pressure. You see how the water is clean, eh? It's too much pressure. This one can fill a 20 liter of jerry can within 30 seconds. Just like that. You see how my well was? Very soft. Now you can even sit here. Like that. Now we'll do the back filling. Eh? Filling there. So that no... Maybe if we say flood. Can get in. You see this? Not like things are what I want. I don't want around the well because they get into the water, die inside there. That's why I, I did this. Eh? So after locking it, nobody can open it and put something bad. You know, some people here at home people sometimes get so much jealous, and you wonder why. So somebody can just come with maybe a snake or something, open here. And throw it here. Of course, it will definitely die. And then after it's dead, now you are busy in the house drinking water. You are drinking a dead snake. That's human. That's people. All people different color. But the color is one, just black. Black is the color of choice all humans eh? if you are brown then there's a problem somewhere you have to be black yeah so i think that's it i'm gonna be showing you because what we want to do right now is we we're gonna have a, a quotation for each and every room for tiling so master bedroom he'll write a quotation for me tell me that if you want to tile master bedroom now this is the amount of cement you need, the boxes of tiles you need, so that maybe, if maybe I have 50,000 and I want to tile, I just choose from the rooms, which room can fit this 50,000. Then we go for its tiles, cement and everything, and it's done. For a master, a, a, a master bedroom for, I just feel like that I left one tap, one, one, that light was on, eh? that one. So for this living room, he put how many tiles is needed here. How many bags of cement can be put here or can be used? Eh? So I'll have a rough idea of how many boxes of tiles and bags of cement are needed for each and every room, including the corridor. So with that, I can always decide now. If I have 20,000, this one is enough for bathroom. More? No. This is enough for a bathroom. I go, I go for it. Just tile that one. If I get 100,000, I know this one is enough for living room. I go for tiles. And I work on that one. I thought that is better because collecting all that money, it's very expensive. Sometimes you just have to do things slowly by slowly. <laughs> 
because the plumber is it's done he's already gone and uh, the left the, the, the part that is left because he, he already fixed these ones eh? these ones are really fixed there are some parts he's left eh? so for the part left for the part left he said that he will come back when the tiling is already done so that's what I want to work on. We fix this other one also as well. And the toilets. So we are just left with tiling. So I'll start with the crucial rooms. Eh? That's the crucial rooms first before we go to those other rooms. That uh, I can't say they are not crucial but they can always wait i want at least plaster one not plaster but tile one room i think i'll start with master bedroom so that at least i avoid this that at least the room we've started clearing these are the only box boxes we have left this one i'm gonna burn it so there are still some stuff here so this one i want to touch uh, these one are my mirror lights it will also be fixed this one will also burn it so it should be here I don't think if there's something here so this one is gonna be burnt as well yeah so all these are gonna be burnt hey. but right now the house slowly by slowly will it will take shape we'll get it where we want eh? where we want it to be my snake light is still left at least a little bit eh? some rooms haven't been fixed yet other this snake light has seven colors i'm yet to see none of it has been connected none of the snake lights let me go and set this on fire I had some PVC left. Eh? Around, there are only three of them. I don't know where I'll keep them because they are so tall. And I'm yet to start tiling here. Another one is a story of another day. I think I'll I'll keep them in the roof up there. See how my lights are on. As you can see, the bulbs are on. on. These are, are used to keep the bats away. The bats don't like lights. Eh? They really don't like love lights. Let me switch this one off. I hope you are still able to see the brightest man on earth. Yeah. Oh, I forgot to tell you, these ones are now working. Remember them from the previous videos? These are now working. If you don't need a lot of light here, because this one has a lot of light, eh? just switch off that. The switch off those and be left with these ones enough to eat yeah let me go and burn these ones plus any waste we have here
This guy is chilling with snacks here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm chilling with the snacks. Mm, you're chilling with the snacks. <laughs> hmm? You are sick? No. Mm. You're angry? Mm. Ah, but you have snacks here. This one is enough for the day. Just take this and a little bit of water. This one should be taken after some ugali. Ugali? Ugali in the morning. Ten eggs of cuckoos in the morning. <laughs> Collecting waste here. Just in preparation of tiling. I don't know if the plumber left some here. realize that gypsum stuff don't get burnt eh? see like this one somebody is calling me it's a new number hello hello Poa. oh i'm talking about yeah i did time a review Oh, so such an inyone yon nini to me instructions. Yeah, so we are gonna burn yesterday. I burned some here, as you can see, and today we are also burning another one. Yes. Throw it inside once it's really flaming like that. Because eh? getting in there is really a tough job. You can even burn yourself. Eh? Is it really gonna work? 
Let me give it some more time. Siphon is coming with a snack. Hello guys. We are living a simple life. <laughs> I think you should join us one day. Mm. We will experience this. It's very simple. We eat, we stay, we love. Mm. Every day. So simple. Ah. All day a day. Mm. I'm burning I'm burning these ones here. And you want to buy a, a TV now. <laughs> no, at least we should do tiling. That house is still very dirty. <laughs> we should do tiling. But if you want to buy me a TV, why not? Real soon, isn't you? We are we are getting bored sometimes. Bas. That one now is called Wazimu. <laughs> The name has changed. The name has changed. <laughs> yeah, so that's it for this video, guys. Uh, I think just like I've told you, I was thinking, Siphon, eh, that the fundi there just give me a quotation because I want to start tiling. Oh, and I start with the, the uh, master bedroom there. The house is beast. This one is going to cost around not less than 500,000. Aye. For tiling only. For tiling only. Mungu wangu. Yes. My lord. Hmm. The one I built for my dad. Hmm. The cost for the tiles was around 150. 150k. Labor was 90. 90. That's uh, close to, to 50 to 60 there. Hmm. So this one. Hey. Hmm. It's going to take a lot of and plus the labor time. now. And the class of the tiles that you want. I, I changed my mind, Buona. But I'm, I'm going to go for the best I can I can manage. Mm. I want to start with the master bedroom because that's where we stay. Mm. At least we do away with that. There's a lot of dust there. Mm. Our laptops are getting dust, dusted and they start polluting. You're using your laptop and your laptop is just like foo, foo. The laptop is really struggling to breathe. Mm. So he'll quote for me every room, number of tiles, boxes needed and the cement so every time i get money because i and at least now have a rough estimate mm. that money will be going to that room that i feel like is around that figure day by day day by day until we finished eh? i will finish tiling that is hell so thank you so much guys for watching this video subscribe let's meet let's meet in the next one Sometimes when you talk too much English, you st your tongue starts to slip. Eh? You say things that you... When you are watching those videos, you are like, I really thought I knew English until you hold this camera like this. Words just run away. But I think I'll get used to it. Eh? I'll get used to it with time. Yeah, this is very flammable. This is the reason why I wanted to just remove these bananas from here. See that one, this one now is changing color because I burnt some stuff here, here yesterday and even the tree. So I don't know what I'll do, but I'll just let them die or I'll move more here. But I have, I already have bananas here in the compound. Even if I lose this, this one will still serve me because we already have. Like this one now, I really pity it, you see. I'll give it a lot of water. Now water tap is just there. After having some moss pipe, I'll just be giving it a lot of water, a lot of it. So that when even when that fire burns its leaves, it can get to. Because I want to be burning things daily. Right now we're just doing away with the waste. Eh? There are a lot of waste in that house. So that's it for this video guys subscribe kindly kindly subscription is free subscribe to my youtube channel like this video comment what you think and let's meet in the next one